Welcome back. So today's video, I'm going to show you guys how I pack my golf bag. This is how I pack it every day when I'm heading to the course to practice or for a tournament. This is not a what's in the bag video. I'm not going to show you all of my clubs. I do have that video already posted, so I will link it, but I will show you how I set up my clubs, what balls I use, how many balls I bring, all the teas, all the snacks, everything. So we're gonna go through my entire bag today. Let's get started. One dead giveaway if you're an amateur golfer is if you have your clubs set up the wrong way. There is a unwritten wrong way and right way to have your bag set up. So it kind of depends on what kind of bag you have. There's different types of different dividers. Uh, there's some dividers that you have 14 dividers, one for each club. For this bag, I always have all of my woods at the top of the bag. So that's my driver, my three wood, and my two hybrids. They're all at the top. I also put my driver and my putter together at the top because those are my two favorites. Um, and then at the bottom, you should have your wedges. Those always hang at the bottom of your bag. And then in the middle, you probably have either two slots, maybe just one slot. You will put all of your irons in the middle of the bag. So that's how you should typically have it set up. You can put your potter at the bottom if you want, but that's kind of amateur. In my bag, I always want to carry with me a few golf clubs. You don't want to blow out a glove and then not have a spare one with you. So I carry a few. This one's brand new. This one you can see is my favorite. It's probably going to catch a hole pretty soon, if not already. So I have backups. Always have a backup one. Another necessity in my golf bag is my range finder with spare batteries. You never want to have a battery die in your rangefinder and not have a backup plan, especially if you're in a tournament that allows rangefinders because then you're just at a disadvantage. So I always make sure I have an extra battery in there, my rangefinder, and I have this really great Monument Golf little attachment on here. This attaches with these magnets to the cart, so it sticks right in front of me the whole time. Okay, so we're going to dive into the main pocket of my golf bag where I keep all of the goodies and I show you what I carry. So in this pocket, first thing is my snacks. I always have plenty of snacks because I get hungry all the time. So these are my favorite on course snacks. They're called Jenna's Divine Bites. They're snicker drizzle flavor. You always want to have something that has some protein in it, gives you some energy while you're out on the course and just be prepared so you don't go hungry on the course. Okay, next in my bag are my rain pants. So you always want to be prepared. I have learned the hard way that forgetting your rain pants is not very fun. So even in Arizona, you never know when a storm's gonna roll through. So just be prepared, have your rain gear. As I said, I live in Arizona, so you know I am locked and loaded with sunscreen. I have so much sunscreen, I'm always prepared. Be safe, be smart, wear your sunscreen. All right, next in my bag is my little chalk rope. So I use this to make a line on the ground for putting. I would recommend anybody, even amateurs, try something like this. Instead of laying down an alignment stick, this allows you to put the ball exactly on the line and putt over it. It just helps you with alignment, it helps you get used to seeing that line and seeing your club go back in a straight line as well. Next are my golf balls. So anytime I go out to practice or play, I always make sure I have a couple sleeves of Pro V1s, not because I think I'm gonna lose two sleeves of Pro V1s, but because I use them to practice as well. So I always wanna have enough so that if I'm doing drills, I have enough golf balls. But yes, I play the Tyler's Pro V1 or the Pro V1X. I kind of play both right now but I, I usually have about six golf balls in my bag. Another kind of random thing that I carry, I always have chapstick on me and eye drops. I'm somebody who has allergies all the time, so I need my eye drops and chapstick. It's just good to have out on the course. Don't want your lips getting chapped. Lastly, I always make sure I carry a bunch of teas. I am somebody who I'm very specific about what tea I like. I love plastic teas. I love the kind that has the little uh, tooth top on it so I'm not somebody who can be out on the course and just find a random tea and pick it up it's not gonna happen so I have to make sure I'm prepared and have enough in case I lose them or break them so that's all I have for you guys today hopefully this helps
helps you figure out a way to set up your bag and gives you some ideas.